DSS. Alright, here we go. We'll see if Usurp is able to find something that he hasn't found before in this matchup or not. Bring his portals already. That's a small movement, making quick progress through the bracket. A couple of nares are going to connect. Nice little jab onto the Usurp. He's going to find, it. find himself through the leg. Loud comes through with the grab though. Nice connection. Rob is uh Rob's finding these connections with DSS. That's what he needs today, man. Yeah, as Wari, not Snake. I assume he goes uh ZSS in this matchup because it sucks. <laughs> um and he probably knows that Easter doesn't uh doesn't know too much about this matchup and Rob coming through with the up airs. Grab not gonna connect. No follow through for Easter. That's tough. <laughs> Rob on ledge just Usurp and charging up that up smash. He, uh, he does that sometimes. Rob not able to find a punish off it though. Usurp finds the ledge into a falling forward air, but Rob is immediately going to be able to shut it down. That's good stuff from him. Usurp again just letting an up smash rip. Rob's going to be wise to that though. He is no fool. Rob SSBU is no fool. Here we go. Just that, that Zare peppering back and forth to try and find some sort of connection, but man. Gets put on the platform against Ridley. It's just gonna, that's going to be up smash every time, man. He's got that. Um, up there's coming through. And now Rob might struggle to find a kill. The up airs are coming through, but not going to do it. He's open up the ledge. Rob just letting the boost kick rip. And there we go. We got four airs off stage. Rob trying to make it back. He does so. That's where things can get scary, man. When you got a... When Easter open has a lead against you and then he puts you off stage, that, that can get scary real quick because... Uh, he can find those ledge guards, some crazy Ridley stuff off stage to uh, take a super early stock. But Rob is going to be able to make his way back, avoid any of that type of thing happening. Trying to connect with some sort of kill move, does it there with the back air. There we go. Rob is able to uh, secure a stock quick enough to not, um, uh, uh, as to not let the game get out of his hands. Has he started at the ledge again, but the ledge pressure isn't going to be strong enough. Still in the corner, though. Rob is kind of... Hold on to this platform and he finds a little bit of a ladder. The boost kick not going to connect. The up airs. Um, we'll do the trick. A little bit of damage to put on. He certainly goes from the side B. It's almost like Rob uh, didn't tech on purpose and waited up the side B. The boost kick was nasty, but he's not able to make it back. That's rough. Rob, a couple of unfortunate miscues here in game one. Let's think about Rob, though. Sometimes the, uh, the ZSS can take a minute to uh, get warmed up, but once it does get warm, uh, it can get real hot real quick. Uh, that could be a problem to deal with. Trying to mix up on shield, does so successfully. Able to connect, but where is the kill here? Again, 123%. This is where uh, this is where ZSS can struggle sometimes. Trying to find this kill. And there we go. That's there in two aerial is gonna do it. Not sure which aerial is not even back here. I don't know much about ZSS moving, I'm not gonna lie. One of my least knowledgeable carriers. And that, that, that flip kick could have been terrifying, but no cigar ZSS has some uh, crazy offs off stage shenanigans of her own, but way below, not going to make it back. Rob, unable to find the recovery. Um, losing game one, I imagine just going to run back the same matchup. After the first game, the stage is good. So, Daniel's stage is, and then whoever won has to say their character. That stay there? Has to say, say their character. Oh, so do the stage first. You say everything. Yeah. Yeah. But you still ban stages first, and then I say yes. character? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh. Uh, to say. Um, it definitely felt doable. Rob just had a few miscues. Um, I believe two SDs in that last game. Um, yeah, as I said, I believe Rob's DSS can sometimes take a sec to get warm. But once it is, I do imagine we'll see those SDs coming through much less. A bit more consistently. There we go. That Zare is going to connect. Nice little extension. The dash attack going to come through. Up to 37% now as he's surfing. Another Zare. The Nair coming through. They're not going um, to not going to connect. <laughs> yeah, Forte, no SD this time, and he's got it. He's got it without SDs. The up smash, not going to connect. Rob is, uh, Rob's going to be safe about that. Down tilt coming through for Serpent. Send the Rob just back and forth. This game is just an absolute slugfest so far. Much less evasive for both players than it was last game. 
Um, and Rob's going to get way out there, find that back here. Nice way to secure that stock. In about 40 seconds, that feels a lot better for Rob. Finds himself a bit of comfort. e Surfer's just going to wait in the center of the stage. Let the skewer rip, but it's not going to connect. Thought he had the movement read, but he did not. Dash attack coming through. e Serpent bringing this game back rather quickly. The dash attack connects, but e Serpent's still in a great spot right now. The side B is almost getting a kill. Surprised by how, how close that was to killing. Rob finds himself back on stage. Is there in the nair is big. Down there by ledge isn't going to do the trick. e Serpent's up tilt does. Let the taunt rip. Shout out e Serpent for taunting. <laughs> Paralyzed or legs not going to connect. Rob trying to find something. The boost kick not going to be the thing to do it. Flip kick coming through. No connection. And there's the grab for Rob. That's big. He's surfing off stage again. Rob barely missed timing that Zara. I think he had the movement option red for E Serpent, but uh, just wasn't quite able to find the connection. And there is the Zare. Oh, but the side B. Is E Serpent able to make it back in this? Yeah, he's going to be able to make it back. Rob gets gimped. That's rough. E Serpent finds a little bit of cheese, and here we go. He's going to be waiting by ledge, trying to do that again. Um, has Rob in the corner here, the Nair. Into down tilt, no dice on that, though. Side B's coming through for Rob, trying to find something to secure this skill. The up B's going to do it. That's going to that's gonna get the stock. Rob now uh, got to find some sort of connection, not let E Serpent um, hit you with anything foolish. Nair's coming through into jab. That's a bit of damage. Down tilt as well. The Zare putting on a lot of pressure on East Serpent, but he's able to make his way back to the middle of the stage. Reset the position, but the Zare and the Nair is going to come through again for Rob. Just consistent damage. Um, East Serpent uh, hasn't really gotten a good hit off since since taking that stock. And there's Zare into Nair. Sends East Serpent way off stage again. There's the up beat. Another back air coming through for Rob. This is big. Is East Serpent able to make it back? The Paralyzer are not going to connect. Rob has him in the corner still, though. F tilt coming through. E Serpent way off stage, making it back, mixing up his timing. Just gonna let an up be rip. And Rob unable to find something on that tech in. That Nair's gonna summon E Serpent off stage yet again. E Serpent's been off stage for a whole lot of time in this last stock. Finds his way back to the ledge yet again. Ooh, the side B comes through, but no punish for Rob. I thought that would have been the stock. Real laggy move missing, and Rob in a great spot to punish it, but unable to do so. The Zare's coming through. Another Zare, no follow up on it. And Rob has East Serpent at 150%, just about um, any of ZSS's kill options are killing right now. Trying to just trying to find something raw at this point. East Serpent just waiting on ledge. Really has a great ledge hand. Rob unable to find any of those connections. Oh no, there it goes. Off stage. This is where East Serpent could do something crazy, and he does. 160% lands the uppy to take the stock. Loser's bracket is stacked today. Holy shit.